Russian army lost more than 1,800 people, 200 units of equipment in Kupiansk during week. During the week, in the Kupiansk direction, the enemy suffered losses of 1,826 soldiers. Also, 200 units of equipment were destroyed. This was announced by the head of the Public Relations Service of the Command of the Ground Forces of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, Volodymyr Fito. In total, during the week in the Kupiansk direction from November the 1st to the 6th, the enemy suffered losses in the amount of 1,826 soldiers. Also, 200 units of equipment were destroyed, including 22 tanks and 54 armored fighting vehicles, Fito said. The Ukrainian army may take advantage of the fact that Russia is expending huge manpower and resources and turn the situation around in the areas of the front line. Ukrainian military expert Alexander Kovalenko believes that Ukrainian forces may liberate Tokmak in the Zaporizhia region. In the Kherson region on the left bank of the Dnipro, the Grey Zone is expanding and the Russian command cannot do anything about it. The Russian defense is also weakening in the Luhansk region, he said.